Hello everybody, this is Jessica and I am here to share with you um, May May Made It's new stamp set. It's called Oh Snap and I just love it. It has strike a pose, smile, BFF, shake it, take a picture, it lasts longer, making memories, so stinking cute, say cheese, picture perfect, a perfect day. So here's a little Polaroid. So you can stamp this and you will get this effect by stamping that. And this is a, this is Happy Father's Day from a different stamp set. Um, this is from Gina K Designs. Um, but this is what the Polaroid looks like stamped. And then you can just fussy cut around it. You can use your gypsy and design it with the dimensions on your gypsy and then cut it out. And that would give you this effect. And this is the exact size of the Polaroid. Or you can you can actually cut it out a little bit bigger so that you have so that you can have the the black to show. So with this one the black wouldn't show because this is the exact dimension and then with this one you can actually see the black which would be um, so and then this is this piece without me fussy cutting the middle part and that is what you get here so this is this here and then this one would be without fussy cutting the circle the inside square so you can just stamp on this straight and it would look just like this or you can just use fuzzy cut the inside and then you have this so with all that mumble jumble said I have a design hop and so I'm I am excited to share my project um, this will be posted on Friday but I didn't do this on Friday I actually did this on Wednesday because I'll be in surgery on Friday so this is my design team project it says picture perfect and the reason why I did this this is actually a frame and the kids picture is gonna go here this is for my class at church I teach the little kids and this is gonna be their Father's Day um, frame to give to their dads and let me show you something so let me put that there and I use that picture perfect from in there and I use the Polaroid um, Walmart sells these may tags three and a half by five inch and they have hit them horizontal or vertical um, and they have like a little stand and it just it has a film right now and so I just have to pull off the film which I'm not going to do this very second but I am just not going to insert this in there I wanted it to be a little bit bigger and this is for their daddies so I was just going to glue it onto the back and then it stands and I'll take you, my little girl's holding my husband's iPad, and so it's going to look like that. Isn't that cute? And there's a little mustache and a button, picture perfect, three little buttons. That is, the paper that I used, here you can go. The paper I used was this $3 paper pad from Walmart. Um, it's called Natural Expression. It's just 100 sheets super cute papers in there super inexpensive so I used that to make that design and I am also um, going to show you this this is a Maytag 3.5 by 5 but this is a magnet photo frame so it's hard and it's a magnet in the back so you could also glue this straight onto the magnet and then they could put it on the fridge. This is great for Mother's Day but not for Father's Day. Father's Day fridge, more mom decoration for fridge. I prefer to do it here um, for Father's Day and just have it stand on dad's desk um, or work um, space. So anyways, I'm going to show you guys really quick how I made this card. I mean how I made this. This is a little hard to do with my little girl. Um, videotaping right on top with a big huge iPad 
Um, so, this one's going to be a little bit different because this is just scraps. I haven't cut out all the pieces for this one, but here we go. So, so you would put this note um, is from, I dare to say, it's from Accent Essentials. It's a Cricut cartridge. And I'm just layering. And the reason why I layered this many was so that I could get um, a chipboard effect. So this way I don't have to buy chipboard. I was going to cut out, I would use some cereal boxes. I figured it'd just be too much work. Um, I'm not feeling good at all. So here's a piece of paper. I don't even have my glue here. I'm going to use temporary adhesive for now. And then I'll finish gluing it when I'm off camera. And then... So this is just another look. So this is another piece of scrap. Here's a frame I cut out using the stamp set, the stamp set right here. I just fussy cut around it with an exacto knife. Try to put a little bit of adhesive on there. And I'm gonna glue this well when we're off camera, but right now this works. And then you can make it as inexpensive or as complicated as you want it to be. Here I just took a little punch and punched out that same piece of paper scrap and I put a little mustache there. And I actually put the sentiment here because this has pattern to it. It's this picture perfect. Look how super cute that is. And I pop I put dimensional underneath the little mustache. But look how cute for them to give their dad for Father's Day. Do you guys see that? Super cute, huh? So there's another, and that's without the tool. Of course, I like this one a lot better, and I'm going to be doing those. But here's another simple way to do it. If you have to mass produce, that's just perfect. Um, here's a, you know, you can make it, I, here I only use two, three. Here I use four. So I use four top notes on this one and three on this one. And so mass produce these as fast as as easy as you can be so look this one I, I I use a different stamp set but just to show you guys isn't that cute and simple so with all that said this stamp set is come join us in our blog hop because that's what we have today Friday and this is my project for the blog hop um, it is called it's by May May and then it's called O Snap, and you can go to maymaymadeit.com to get your stamps or her SD, um, and you can get these. It's only ten ninety nine and two dollars for U.S. shipping and three dollars for outside the U.S. Super inexpensive and stamps really really cute and perfect. So love it, picture perfect. Aren't that what our children are? Picture perfect always. No matter how silly they may be, but there's some really cute, so stinking cute, some really cute scenes. So, hope you guys enjoy and um, have a great day. Thanks for um, watching my videos and leaving comments. Have a great day. Bye.